This is me, Big Guy, back at Country Classic Cars on November 13th. Out here this Saturday, gloomy cold day. It's not going to stop me from coming in here and looking at some cars and sharing the videos with you. So, um, I'm, I'm looking for something new that they brought in since I haven't been here in a, for a little while. But I'm pretty sure we'll find something, you know. Something that's going to be nice as usual. Something nice and clean. Uh, something you probably could restore or drive as is. You never know. Hey, let's have some fun. Hey guys, okay, now I found one right off the bat. Found a nice Pontiac. A nice Trans Am, Firebird, whichever. You know, you guys love old Pontiacs and uh, this one fits the bill. Since Pontiac is not around anymore, this is an excellent car to have some fun with. You know, come in, buy it as is, or fix it up. Turn it to a racer, take it to the track. You know, let's look at it. Okay, guys, hey, look, it's an 86 Trans Am. This one's pretty clean. As I was looking at the body, it looks like it's pretty clean, no dents. I don't see too much. The hood looks a little different than the rest of the paint, but, you know, replacement hood. Hey, man, it's an 86, you never know. <laughs> All the stuff that have went down. This thing has a real nice body. I'm not looking at much rust. If I'm finding anything, look at here. You got a lock on the gas cap. I don't see any rust to it. If you have a, if you're looking at this video and see a little shaky, I've got to walk in between all these cars. And there's never much room here at Country Classic Cars because they got so many cars here. You know, it's always full of cars. But this one here is a nice Pontiac. Oh, yeah. The interior looks like it's pretty clean. Look inside. Hey, that dashboard looks like it's pretty well kept. It's automatic. These seats look pretty good. Passenger side. Let's look in the back. You get a peep in. Well, hold on, let's try this. Back seats look pretty clean. Yeah, this is nice. Oh, there's a hatchback, so you got that room in the back there. I didn't see that. Yeah. Instead of a truck, you get that open space. You put whatever you need back there. Let's take a look at the other side. Driver's side seat looks just as good as the uh, passenger seats. Seventy-three thousand miles on there. What is that? Seventy-nine. It looked like seventy-three. Yeah. Got the everything in it with the radio, air conditioning, everything you would want. And this car's T-top. Let's look at the information. Okay, guys, it's an 86 Pontiac Trans Am, T-top. Two imported V8. Got the auto power stereo power brakes, AC. You guys see the price? It's here at Country Classic Cars. Give them a call. Come pay a visit. Okay, guys, hey, I found another one. Except this time it's an import. It was a very popular import. I mean, these were must-have back in the day. It's a 1983 Datsun Z280 or 280Z with a straight six, five speed. And it's sitting here at Country Classic Cars. Let's take a look at it. Look at this thing, man. 
this thing here is a true survivor. These are hard to find. I remember I had a cousin who had one of these things. His was green, though. It looked just like this, but I don't know what year it was, but this thing is nice. I don't know if we're going to be able to get back here to see the back end of this thing. It's parked up close to this truck, but I'll do the best I can. Yeah. Tail lights and everything. It don't look like this car had any damage to it. You see the exhaust right there. So it's a hatchback, wiper in the back, antenna. No spoiler, but who cares? And for you T-top lovers, it's got T-tops. <laughs> Take a look in the inside real quick. Seats look good. Five speed, can you believe it? On a straight six. Dashboard don't look too bad. Steering wheel's wrapped. Wow, this is a nice car. As we look at it from the other angle, passenger side, this thing's pretty clean. Yeah, this car, a true survivor of time. I can't find much wrong with it. Although I am not a crazy type person for T-tops. And I don't go crazy for them. But to find one with T-tops in this condition, yeah, it's a true treasure. You can take this thing and just rebuild it if you want. Paint it a different color if you want. It's up to you. I don't know if this is the original hood, as you can see with the design. If somebody in the comments on it, please, somebody watch this video and they comment on it, let me know if this actually was the original hood or if this was something different. Because you got the Z badge on here, but that don't always mean anything. You know how people love to change stuff. So, hey, great find.